Safe timing can be crucial, especially during in vitro fertilization. Yeah, doctors at Texas Fertility Center are offering a new procedure that helps determine the best time to implant an embryo. KV's Rebecca Trejo introduces us to a Central Texas couple who credits the test for their baby on the way. Here's his face, here's his hair, here's a lot of hair. Mary Davenport shuffles through baby Emmett's ultrasound pictures. Face. <laughs> He's still about a month away from seeing the world. He's a ham. Yes. But his parents are bursting with excitement. My belly button. <laughs> their desire to have a child of their own. When I was a little girl, that's what I wanted to be when I grew up. I wanted to be a mom. They spent more than $50,000 on three unsuccessful in vitro fertilization or IVF cycles. We each weren't ready to quit. So it was a learning curve for each of us to figure out what worked. So doctors recommended the endometrial receptivity analysis procedure. Dr. Kaylin Silverberg says tissue from a woman's uterine lining is removed and protein expressions in cells are evaluated to determine what day during a woman's cycle is best for embryo implantation. And so now this test has really eliminated one of the last remaining variables and one of the last remaining barriers to success with IVF. More than 200 patients have already used the test at the Texas Fertility Center. <laughs> for the Davenports, they were willing to spend several hundred dollars more for one more chance. I just, I love having my little baby in there and feeling him every day. And I, I look forward to, to meeting him. In Austin, Rebecca Trejo, KVU News. I see the joy in her face for sure. The Davenports say they would be willing to try the procedure again for a second child. Doctors at the Texas Fertility Center say ERA, that ERA procedure, costs about $700 plus $300 for a biopsy. Well, it's a product.